Shalom. <clears throat> All praises are due to Yahweh Bahashem, Yahweh Shai Bahashem, Rechak Kodash. Double honors to the elect apostle, bishop, all that great millstone ever well. Shalom, to like I can't do this work in sincerity and truth and not for vain glory in season and season. All right, just a quick, uh, quick scripture. Uh, this is Judges, the 10th chapter, and I started the uh, 13th verse. Okay, well, actually, I'll read a little bit more. Uh, let me see. Okay. I'll start at the 10th verse. And the children of Israel, which are the so called Negroes, Latinos, and Native Americans, cried unto Yahweh, the Lord saying, we have sinned against thee, both because we have forsaken our God and also serve Balaam. You know, so that's what, that's what so-called Negroes, Latinos, and Native Americans did. <clears throat> okay. All right. You know, so they got distressed. You know, Yahweh by Hashem, Yahweh Shai allowed these heathen nations to come against the nation of Israel, which we're all guilty of this. Okay. All right. You know, but Yahweh by Hashem, Yahweh Shai, in his great mercy, through Yahweh Shai, has brought us back to what? Serving him. Okay. And not serving other gods. All right. Not serving a so called white man as being uh, the Lord. All right. And, and a savior. Okay. All right. He brought us back to what? Serving him. Serving the true power. The true, the true Most High, which is Yahweh and his son, Yahweh Shai. Okay. All right. It says, and the children of Israel cried unto the Lord, Yahweh, saying, we have sinned against thee. Yeah, because when you go into the scriptures, it even when you read about the, the commandments, some of the first commandments was what? Thou shalt have no other gods before me. You know, and that's exactly what we did. I'm talking about you so-called Negroes, Latinos, and Native Americans, because you're the Israelites. I'm talking about the real Jews, which is a so-called black man, black woman. Okay. And the children of Israel cried unto Yahweh, the Lord, saying, we have sinned against thee, because that's the sin. You see, you know, when you praising, you know, the Lord is being a so-called white man. And, you know, it, that's that that's a sin. What is sin? Sin is the transgression of the law. When you praising um, Muhammad and Allah and, and you know, you praising uh, the, the, the Egyptian gods, you know what I'm saying? You know, you praising anything other than Yahweh Bahashem, Yahweh Shai. Okay? Worshipping anything besides Yahweh Bahashem, Yahweh Shai. That's breaking the laws, having other gods. You know, and Balaam was one of the gods back then. One of the many gods that Israel started worshiping, okay? <clears throat> That's sin, okay? You know, now these Negroes, Latin, so-called Negroes, Latinos, and Native Americans, they have no excuse. Why? Because the prophets of the Lord have been out there and telling them, listen, the Lord is not a so-called white man. Look, you ain't no damn Muslim. Stop praising them goddamn Egyptian gods, man, okay? You know? being a damn Egyptologist or the, the black unconsciousness movement. Okay? The black conscience movement. You know? Putting up idols in your house, man. You know? It says, we we have sinned against thee both because we have forsaken our our power, our God, and and also serve Balaam. You know, and that's what Two thirds are gonna say in that day. I'm talking about you, so-called Negroes, Latinos, and Native Americans, because when Yahweh Shai come, man, yeah, yeah, exactly, exactly. Why? Because because the prophets of the Lord was out there. You heard this, but you denied it. Okay, all right, and you're gonna know that that's the son of the heavenly Father. You're gonna know that's the son of Yahweh. Okay. I'm talking about you so two thirds of you so-called Negroes, Latinos, and Native Americans. All right. And Yahweh 
the Lord said unto the children of Israel, Did not I deliver you from the Egyptians? And yes, Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahweh Shai, the Most High and the Son, delivered the nation of Israel, delivered us, the Israelites, so called Negroes, Latinos, and Americans. He did deliver us from the Egyptians, the ancient Egyptian Empire. Okay? All right? Because those were uh, Hamites. Okay? They were dark skinned people. The Egyptians were dark skinned people. And you Israelites are dark skinned people. And we're dark skinned people. Okay? All right? <clears throat> now, with many different shades of brown. Okay? But, you know, the Hamites were dark skinned. And you so called Negroes, Latinos, and Americans were dark skinned too. And still are to the same very day. Okay? All right? It says, and from the Amorites, from the children of Ammon, and from the Philistines, okay, the, Zid the Zidonians also, and the Amalekites, which were these, uh, which, which are these uh, small hats, okay, the so-called Jews, so-called Jews, okay. Okay. And, and Yahweh Bashim, Yahweh Shai is going to deliver us from the Amalekites again, which are these small acts. He's going to deliver the elect this time, though. See, before he delivered the whole nation of Israel, but this time he's going to deliver the elect of the nation of Israel, the elect of you so called Negroes, Latinos, and Native Americans, because Amalek is in rulership of the earth. Okay? The international Jewish banking families. All right? The Rothschilds and so forth. Okay? We're going to be delivered again. The elect is going to be delivered again, I should say. Okay? From, from the Amalekites. From the Philistines. From the Ammonites. Okay? All right? And the, Menon and the Mennonites did oppress you. And ye cried to me, and I delivered you out of their hand. Yet ye have forsaken me. Yeah, and 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 that's what that's what that's what um that's what so-called Negroes, Latinos, and Native Americans are doing now. Here it is, the Mosai Yahweh Bahashim Yahweh Shai sent his prophets out there, and they said the hell with that. We want to hear that, you know. We want to continue praising the white man as God. We want to continue being a Muslim. We want to continue being um in all these other um Egyptology and all this other madness, you know. You know, you have forsaken me, meaning Israel went and started praising other gods after they were delivered by Yahweh Bahashim, Yahweh Shai, and serve other gods. Wherefore, I will deliver you no more. And that's that happened back then, you know, and it's going to happen now to two thirds of you so called Negroes, Latinos, and Native Americans. Okay. All right. Why? Because you have forsaken Yahweh Bahashim Yahweh Shai and you don't want to come back. OK, but you're going to be delivered anyway. You're just not going to be delivered here in America. OK, only the elect is going to be delivered in America and all and, un, and all the other parts of the world, because you have the elect that's all in all parts of the world, too. But the main deliverance is going to be here in America and wherever the two thirds at wherever part of the world they at, they ain't going to be delivered. But they are going to be delivered. They have to die, come back, and that's how they're going to be delivered. Through the elect. Okay? You know? It says, um, 14 verse. Go and cry unto the gods which ye have chosen. Let them deliver you in the time of your tribulation. You know? And, um, <laughs> yeah, that, that's, hey, that's just going to be the reality. You know, keep that same energy. You know, when Jacob's trouble come, when all hell breaks loose come, when the famine comes, you know, when all hell breaks loose, when the famine comes, when the Gurkha troops come, and when the concentrations are being filled, which is for two thirds of you so called Negroes, Latinos, and Native Americans, well, even some of the elect is going to be in a concentration camps, but guess what? They're going to be delivered. And the ones of the elect that's not going to be delivered and get their head and get 
beheaded. Hey, they, they're coming back with Yahweh Shai. They're going to be the first ones on the chariots. Okay. But just to goes to show you the mercy of Yahweh Bahashem, Yahweh Shai. Okay. And the children of Israel said unto Yahweh, the Lord, we have sinned. Do thou unto us whatsoever seemeth good unto thee. Deliver us only, we pray thee, this day. And the children of Israel, excuse me, Salakit, 16 verse, and they put away the strange gods from among them and served Yahweh, the Lord, and his soul was grieved for the misery of Israel. See, this is how you return back to Yahweh by Hashem, Yahweh Shai, by putting away those strange gods. Okay? You know, and Yahweh Bashim Hashem will deliver you. Okay, but only the elect is going to do that. You know. Then the children of Ammon were gathered together, and encamped in Gilead, and the children of Israel assembled themselves together, and encamped at Mizpah. You know, you know. Then it goes on, and you know, they were eventually delivered. Why? Because they put away them strange gods. They put away the worshiping the, the image of the Lord being the so-called white man. They put away being a Muslim. They put away being a, 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 the black consciousness movement. And all this other madness. Okay? Voodoo and Santa Maria and all that other madness, man. You know? Which is the worship of Satan and other gods. You know? But, uh, you know, I just wanted to bring that out. You know? So, um, yeah, two thirds going, they ain't going to put away them strange gods and they're going to be destroyed for it. But the elect going to put away them strange gods. All right. I hope you edified them with that. Shalom.